Hey y'all, today we have Tecron Complete Fuel System Cleaner versus Valve Gunk. And I can't wait for you to see these valves. I mean, they look really bad. After 30 years of buildup, we had some luck with seafoam. But unfortunately, the problems got worse. We're burning a lot more oil than what we were. So now we're back with some more fuel cleaners to put to the test and see which one really works. Treats up to 15 gallons of gasoline. So you want to add the entire bottle to your gas tank if you have 15 gallons. So if you have half, you want to add about half that. So I have about eight gallons. I'm going to add half this bottle. Some of the claims this makes cleans deposits and gasoline direct injection engines and port fuel injection engines, cleans intake valves, and that's what we are testing out. Also, it says it cleans the combustion chamber. So I'm going to show you guys some before and after takes. Does this really work? Let's go ahead and add it to the fuel. So you can see the fuel right there. We have seven and a half gallons. So guys, you can actually tell there's a lot of carbon buildup on these valves. And I mean a lot. So can it actually help? Well, we're gonna find out. I'm not so sure. This is the very first valve. Let's go to intake valve number two. This is intake valve two. This is before, and as you can see, just as much carbon. Let's move on to intake valve number three. Okay, guys, intake valve number three, before shot. And yeah, this thing is covered with carbon. Let's move on to number four. Okay, guys, here we are at intake valve number four. And wow, is there a lot of carbon buildup. Yeah, this is a tall task, so yeah, definitely a tall task for Tecron. Can Tecron do it? Well, we're going to find out. Okay, guys, after one week of driving, we've ran this fuel out, and I'm really excited to see the results. So, let's go ahead and jump right in. You're watching Nate's Interactive Auto. Did you think this actually worked? Do you think this helped? Do you think it cleaned the intake valves? Drop a comment below. Let us know what you think. Have you tried this product? And does it actually work? Okay, guys, let's go ahead and take a look at these after shots. You can look, see all the carbon buildup. Do you see a difference around the intake valve, on the intake valve? Okay, let's move on to intake valve number two. Intake valve number two, do you see a difference? Still a lot of carbon buildup. Let's move on to intake valve number three and see if we can see a difference. Intake valve number three after shot. Can we see a difference here? Be sure and let me know what you guys think. Did it make a difference? Did it help? Let's move on to number four. Or at intake valve number four. Did this clean up the carbon buildup? Oh wow, this one looks really bad. Like I say, this is a tall task for any cleaner. So definitely let me know what you guys think. I'm really interested to hear. Because like I say, you know, I really hate to be the judge. So drop a line in the comments. Okay, what did you guys think? Do you think this product performed well? Uh, I definitely had my doubts. So... Let me know what you guys thought. I really try not to give my opinion. Sometimes I just can't help myself. I don't want to influence this test in any way. And I'm not promoting these guys. I want to make that very clear. Uh, the test results. I always hope for the test results to come out well. For, so we have a product that works great. That we can use. Definitely let us know how you think the test turned out. Or as I said earlier. If you've done the test yourself. So. Thanks for watching, Nate's Interactive Auto. You guys keep on wrenching.